Hello again. In 2011, the population of London was 8,173,941. Ten years later, in 2021, it had increased by almost 8% to 8,799,800. That means that around 625,000 more people now live in the capital than a decade previously, which means that the equivalent of the entire population of Glasgow has been added to London over the course of just 10 years. By way of contrast, in 2011, the population of the Welsh market town of Brecon was 8,250. According to the 2021 census, this has increased to 8,254, which is an increase equivalent to less than a car load of people. This illustrates neatly the difference between natural increase and increase driven by immigration. For almost the whole of British history, the population of this country has increased naturally. That is to say, a very slightly greater number of people are born as compared with those who die. This natural rate of increase is slow, steady and predictable, making it possible to plan for things like roads, schools, houses and hospitals, as well as water supply, electricity and so on. Because Brecon is pretty isolated, it does not draw immigration. The nearest railway station is 20 miles away and the town is peaceful and quiet. London, on the other hand, acts as a magnet for immigration for all kinds of reasons. One consequence of this is that in Brecon it is possible to plan services and nothing is overwhelmed. When I want to visit London, I have to get a bus to Abergavenny, to the railway station there, and there are seldom more than three or four people on that bus. There is a minor injury unit at the War Memorial Hospital in Brecon, but there's no question of waiting to be seen there. The hospital was opened in 1928, but it's still perfectly adequate for the town's population. Compare this with the crisis in hospitals in London and other big cities. This is, of course, why Brecon is a beautiful and calm place to live with excellent services, because the population changes very gradually by natural increase. When you add the population of Glasgow to a city like London in the space of just 10 years, of course it will make the hospitals far more crowded, as well as the buses and tube trains. It could hardly be otherwise because you cannot increase services that fast. There is no more to this video than that, simply to point out the difference between a town where the population is increasing naturally and a city where the increase is unnaturally rapid and wholly unplanned. 